So compatibility between dialysis membranes and patient's blood is so important factor for patients. Even mild interactions between patient's blood and dialysis membranes may lead to significant problems over time. This project was about improving the compatibility of dialysis membranes currently used in the hospital using heparin because heparin is a well-known medication and prevent harmful clots from forming in blood vessels. Some available commercial dialysers um, have used heparin grafted membranes. However, those uh, commercial ones have an intense negative charge on the surface, which could lead to complications for patients and more negative effects. But in our study, we adopted a new approach. So we maintained using heparin, but at the same time, we neutralized the membrane surface. We had the benefit of have significant reduction in blood clotting and significant reduction also in biomarkers related to cell destruction, which means that we could regulate inflammation to prevent any tissue damage. At this stage, we filed an invention and currently we are working hard to advance it through different stages of development and testing. Working at CLS was always an amazing experience for me because with advanced synchrotron imaging, we could see human uh, serum proteins inside membrane channels uh, during the flow like never before. I believe uh, the quantitative and qualitative data that we achieve at CLS uh, will lead to a real change for dialysis patients and of, of course it, it will make um, University of Saskatchewan and Canada leaders in dialysis uh, membrane technology.